a short little video on the Oppo Find X7 Ultra and how you can get notifications going on on your AOD screen. It's a bit of, well, a little bit more cumbersome than on the Vivo uh, X100 Pro, for example. But uh, let me show it to you now on screen. So this is how it works. I have running ColorOS here and we have to replace a little bit of piece of software here on ColorOS. This is the Chinese version of ColorOS. The global version of ColorOS is called Oxygen OS. It's basically the same thing, just rebranded. And the OnePlus 12 has this for the new Oxygen OS 14, which is based on ColorOS 14. It's called Diverse Engine. So what we first have to make sure is on ColorOS going into our settings, apps and app management, make sure to show all system apps and then search for diverse. There we have diverse engine. And you can see I have version 13.2.63. We have to disable the updates or uninstall the updates because we have uh, from Oxygen OS only version 13.2.60 and uh, yeah, so hit uninstall here, hit uninstall, uninstallation complete. You can see we have 13.2.60 right now. And then we can install the Oxygen OS version that I already downloaded. I will put a link uh, to this APK down below. As you can see here, diverse engine from Oxygen OS. And we can just simply say reinstall here. It's the same version and it will install this uh, new diverse engine search for stuff and then it's installed and that's basically it what you have to do nothing else you have to do for this uh, afterwards the aod will show you a notification with this global version of the um, uh, of the diverse engine what you have to do in the app market on color os you will see that you will get an update there to the new 13263 version of diverse engine just ignore this update or put it to the ignore list so it will be ignored and you don't update this diverse engine and of course if the new color os version will land and will update the diverse engine then we have to get a new oxygen os uh, version of this diverse engine really why is it not configurable oppo you can make it configurable why you have to like split it like this i don't understand at all why not making it just configurable so that you can choose which apps to land on the AOD. Anyway, this is how it works. And this is a short little um, yeah, tutorial on how it works. And um, maybe I can demonstrate to you how it will work and look like. And here you can see now the AOD after I did this. So you can see I have my Huawei Health. I can see the night mode enabled. And I can see I downloaded a file. And if someone sends me Telegram message, it will also appear here. Let's uh, check out how it looks like. So here you can see the Telegram message appeared there. So yeah, this AOD trick is working fine.